Greetings and welcome to the Astronomy Picture of the Day podcast. Today's picture for January 2nd of 2025 is titled Solar Analemma 2024. So what do we see here? Well, here we see an image or many images of the sun put together and in fact taken from the exact same location at various different days over the course of 2024. So the first image taken on January 9th of 2024 down toward the bottom there and the last image taken on December 22nd of 2024 very close to that first object. So the sun makes a figure eight pattern in the sky over the course of a year. Now you can only see this by taking an image of it from the exact same location. And by that I mean you pretty much have to have that exact place there. So you take that put a camera out and you just take a picture every day at the exact same time. In this case it was 1 p.m. that it was taken. So by doing that, you find out where the sun is in the sky. Now, the reason for this pattern that we see has to do with a couple of things in Earth's orbit. It is stretched up and down because of the tilt of Earth's orbit. And that changes how high the sun is in the sky over the course of the year. In the winter, down toward the lower part of the analemma, then it is very low in the sky, even at that same time. Just a few months later in the summer, up at the peak there, then the, the sun will be very high in the sky. So that's one of the things that we get with our seasons related to the tilt of Earth's axis. The tilt is 23 and a half degrees, and that's what we're seeing reflected here. We can go 23 and a half degrees above or below the celestial equator, and that will give us that 47 degree shift in the position of the sun between winter and and summer. Now the other thing that we get is that it's stretched out in kind of a figure eight form. Now that has to do with the apparent motion of the sun across the sky. Sometimes the sun moves a little bit slower and sometimes it moves a little faster. Now the reason for this is not the sun but is of course our own earth. Because while we see the sun move across the sky over the course of a day and over the course of a year, it's really the earth that is doing the moving. The Earth spins on its axis and the Earth revolves around the sun and that causes the changing positions. But the Earth does not go at a constant speed. The Earth is in an elliptical orbit. So sometimes it's moving a little bit faster and sometimes it's moving a little bit slower. And that can adjust how wide this figure eight would be. The more elliptical the orbit were, this more stretched out this would be. And the less elliptical it is, the closer it would be to being just a straight line going up and down. So these two things combined together give us the analemma. If the Earth were not tilted on its axis, and if its orbit were perfectly cir circular, then you'd essentially see the sun at the same spot every single day. But because of those two things, we get the pattern here as demonstrated in this image for the year 2024. So that was our picture of the day for January 2nd of 2025. It was titled Sonar Solar Analemma 2024. We'll be back again tomorrow for the next picture, previewed to be Eclipse Pair. So we'll see what that is about tomorrow. And until then, have a great day everyone. And I will see you in class.